I regret carrying my sister-in-law's baby, I feel trapped, I need to vent, as I'm going through a lot, my first language is Spanish, and I'm just blocking out any comments saying I should be silent or that I'm just here to complain, I don't need more people treating me like a vessel without feeling, I tried posting about this in a group, but I only received harsh replies from people who assumed I was trying to take my sister-in-law's baby, apart from my close family and friends, I don't really have anyone to talk to about this, and I don't want to overwhelm them, my sister-in-law and her husband had many challenges with their pregnancy, my husband persuaded me to carry their child because they've gone through so much, and our pastor at church mentioned it would be a kind deed. Looking back, I feel pressured. I didn't know them well, but from what I'd seen, they seemed like good people. She tried many costly treatments to conceive, but it didn't work. Months into the pregnancy, I'm starting to feel like I'm just an incubator, as though I don't exist as a person anymore. They constantly touch my belly, and when I tell them I'm uncomfortable, they get upset, saying it's their baby. They've even tried to put restrictions on my relationship with my husband, saying it's inappropriate while I'm carrying their child. They've made comments that make me feel like my body isn't my own. I'm not seen as a person, just a belly. They were very unhappy when I told them I wasn't comfortable doing a photo shoot with my sister-in-law pretending my belly was hers, like she saw on Pinterest. They even wanted to edit my face out or cover it. When I said I didn't feel well enough to go to the baby shower she planned for herself, my husband talked me into going. At the shower, she was upset when people asked me how I was feeling and coping. Afterward, she told her family to ask her, not me, about how I'm doing since it's her baby. I keep a journal to note how I feel and the changes I experience. When my sister-in-law found out about it, she cried and insisted that I should update her daily with my thoughts and feelings. She claims I'm keeping her out of the experience because, in her words, she's spiritually carrying the baby. When I mention feeling unwell, she mimics my symptoms, and everyone focuses on her as if she's also going through the pregnancy. Recently, my mom came to visit and felt the baby move in my belly. My sister-in-law's husband was in the house and became angry, saying it's their baby and that I shouldn't let anyone touch my belly. They also send me countless messages every day to check what I'm doing, and I can't even go on vacation without constant updates. My family and friends have told me I made a huge mistake, and I know they're right. I feel so sad and stuck. My husband even watches what I do and reports back to my sister-in-law. I feel trapped in a situation I can't escape. I've started to realize they may not be mentally ready to raise a child. They were even furious when the baby's gender wasn't what they expected, even though they claimed it was meant to be. They have strong, unsettling beliefs. I'm genuinely scared, for myself and for this child's future. I've always been a person of faith, but I'm starting to question things. They say that my purpose is to carry their child, but I'm beginning to think this is a sign that they're not prepared to be parents at all. I feel so much guilt, bringing this child into the world who will be raised by them. I've tried setting boundaries in every way I can, but now I feel intimidated. I can't afford a lawyer if they decide to go against me. Legally, the baby is mine until I sign papers to give them full rights but they've threatened legal action, and I'm scared. The egg isn't even hers, it's from a donor, though it's a family secret that no one speaks about. 